When I first started working at Namoy, I was just blown away by the sheer size of, of the task that you get to undertake every season with ginning. Um, you know, you can walk into any gin anywhere and it's unlike anything you'll see in any other environment. Uh, the moon buggies, just the, the sheer size of the kit. It's amazing, I've shown it to all of my mates that are engineers and they, they love that sort of stuff. I get a lot of chance to go out on farm and, um, and spend a lot of time with the growers learning about what they do, playing into other people's production systems and you know, even if you're only a short part of that chain and helping getting something closer to market, is, it's a really rewarding environment. Uh, you've got very, very defined start and stops, you know exactly where your season is which allows you to plan for everything around that. And I also like the autonomy. So. Uh, in the off season when you're not ginning, you know, you've got the flexibility to make your life and your work your own and, and build your own schedule. So that part really appeals to me. So the cotton industry was a standout for me in terms of how far you could push a particular crop in this area. Uh, you sort of find that from an innovation point of view, they seem to go as hard and as fast at any particular um, yeah, any particular direction that they pick to go in. They're, they're incredibly committed. It's a very small industry as well, so uh, you tend to see a lot of the same faces, which is good from a developmental point of view because there's a lot of continuity there in the industry. And it's a great industry with a lot of energy and a lot of innovation. 